This is a Ford Skyliner retractable hard top. These were made from 1957 to 1959. The hard top retracts into the trunk and comes out when needed. And then the car becomes a two door coupe with all the advantages of a proper hard cover. It's controlled by a sequencer, similar to the uh, design by Chris Shute. Chris's sequencer was fully programmable and had 32 positions. This one only has 16 and it's hardwired just to suit this model. Just simpler to put together. It still contains Chris's uh, mechanical reversing switch as I found that I could not improve on it with latching relays. But we'll start the sequence by pressing this button. The polarity reverses. The sequencer moves to the next position and the deck lid rises. The sequencer moves on. Polarity is reversed again and now the roof comes out. It should really tilt the other way but it's too difficult to model in Meccano. Once the roof is in position, the package tray folds down. I really need a faster motor here, as this is a bit too slow, but I don't have one yet. It's a very small N30 motor, as room is so limited in this model. The sequencer moves around again and the deck lid folds down. The sequencer moves round a few steps uh, because those steps aren't needed and we'll start the sequence again to retract the roof. The lid comes up. The roof is pulled back into the trunk. The package tray folds out. Polarity reverses and the deck lid drops down with the package tray folded out to fill in the space normally occupied by the roof. That's the operating sequence. I've not bothered to model either the engine of the car or the steering as these really aren't important in this model. And I've not taken too much care to model the car's appearance exactly, but it's not too bad. 
the back end of the car is a bit too bulky. It always rolls a bit large and Ford had to make a different body design to accommodate the roof and its mechanism. We can look at one of the screw drives which are used to make everything work. Here you can see the motor is operating a screw jack and that raises the lid and there are limit switches to stop the motor. The roof is now coming out and this is happening in a similar way this motor operating another screw jack to lift the roof. That's it for the Ford Skyliner. Thanks for watching.